Hello everyone, me phone here, and I'm Son of Beast. As you all know, that the season of the NBA is officially done for the year. Now it's time to step into the postseason and get started for the NBA playoffs on 2K Sports. Who will be heading to the second, the championship game of the conference, and in the NBA Finals? Find out. Once this game starts here in the first round, let's get started on 2K Sports. Hello everyone, Son of Beast here and me phone 4 and this is where it comes down to the NBA first round of the playoffs. It's between the New York Knicks and the Cleveland Cavaliers, as both teams have three. The next one wins, will move on to face on against the Milwaukee Bucks of the first seed at Milwaukee. Will it be the New York Knicks, or will it be the Cleveland Cavaliers? Let's find out. Standing by, we have is Brian Anderson, along with the 2K Sports crew, and Ali LaForce is right here on the sideline. Guys, enjoy the last game of the first round before we head in to the next part of the game of the Bucks and the winning team. That will be happening here for the next couple days. That will be happening every day in between. So, there is a solution. The Knicks or the Cavaliers. Let's find out how well they do. On now to the final game of Game 7. Here we go. Happy and happy everyone. part of the game out here at the Rocket NBA Mortgage Fieldhouse. Now let's get right into Kevin Arlen. And tonight, it'll be the New York Knicks going up against the Cleveland Cavaliers here in Rocket Mortgage Fieldhouse. This is Brian Anderson. I'm here with Hall of Famers Grant Hill and Doris Burke, our reporter, Ali LaForce. Ali, take it away. Well, guys, dramatic progression for point guard Darius Garland. A rough rookie season, but last year he became an all-star. He said it's just trusting the work that he puts in every day. And while his shooting is special, he said, quote, I'm an all-around point guard that gets my teammates involved. Brian? He's highly skilled, Allie. Thank you. And now the opening lineup for New York. Key matchups in between the Darius Garland Josh and Jalen Brunson. Jalen Brunson and Robinson in at the five, down low. And for the Cavaliers, the lengthy pair of Mobley and Allen are together inside. Darius Garland is out there with Donovan Mitchell, and it's Okoro in at the three. And we're expecting an intense battle in the front court tonight, Grant. Both teams with a lot of talent in those positions. It'll be, a, it'll be an interesting matchup here with the talent and size of their front court. It should make this game extra challenging for these squads. They can't just count on being the dominant force down low. They'll have to get a little creative. Here's Okoro. Pocket six, and play stops. I'll put the foul on Cleveland Cavaliers, number four, Evan Mobley. His first personal foul. New York Knicks foul.
defensively by Robinson. Mitchell Robinson's focus on high percentage looks has given him record-setting efficiency doors. It has, B.A., in the abrupt 2020 season, he finished with a field goal percentage. Mitchell Robinson. This is too hard. Josh Hart. I think that says it all. And that was the mobile one drive. No resistance to the finish line. Get a nice finish from him on that drive. Uses his body well and helps extend the lead. Back to Mitchell. Looking to win the run. Can't hit that one. New York goes the other way with it. Is a three. Now Robinson. Oh, Mitchell Robinson. This is from Julius Randle. Robinson's got a second basket. I just love the ball. Timeout gaps. Don't seem to be clicking for them offensively. Yeah, they really need to find a way to get back on track. Cleveland calls timeout. Outplayed in the previous game on their schedule, losing to the Knicks. A missing piece was their offensive rebounding. There were just way too many one-and-done possessions for them. You know, if you're going to create more points, you need to create extra possessions. And getting wiped out on the boards kept that from happening. And if you guys can't even remember this one here, so without the New York Knicks, they're moving on to the next round in the real game. But as, as you always know, Ranger fans, unfortunately, this real game of the Stanley Cup class has overturned New Jersey Devils. Oh, we're in the second round. Oh, yeah. I'm so happy right now. You know, I'm always a Devils fan because me phone 4 never really stops showing it off. It's showing some Jersey love, people. And I know you all, Jersey fans, are so excited to see the Devils making their way all the way down to the finals. If you want to see them, well, you got to cheer on louder. Well, I'm always, like, disappointed already, but that, that didn't slow it down. So I'll have to, like, just say... Well, good luck with the Devils. They're moving on, and good luck in the second to make it to the championship round. Well, we'll see how it goes. Back to you, Brian. Josh Hart for three. This is from Julius Randle. Defense is three second violation. On number 23, Mitchell Robinson. Shooting at the typical free throw line. Share it out. You know, Brian, trend in this league right now. Only one shot. Sacrifice a player's health. Well, it's all about a player's health, VA, when it's all said and done. A player with minor injuries are usually held out now, sometimes even against their own will. A much different situation than when I was playing many years ago. Mitchell, no good on the free throw. New York Knicks. That's in Grimes and over the divide. And hard inside. He's a great threat at the rim because he's a for the Number 32. That's my way. Number three, Karis Levert. Comes in for a Donovan! Mitchell! Third out with the six. For a big man, that's a pretty pass. Number 32, Karis Levert. R.J. Bell. This from Julius Randle. Got three assists tonight. Mitchell's scoring abilities have often been a difference maker for us. The VA, that's been especially true in the playoffs. Highly competitive, all about the right things. Here's Wade. Chucks! Lover! That's been Wade for these six. Two minutes remaining in the first quarter of the period. Two minutes. Brunson passes to Barry. Back to Brunson. 
two for seven. A sluggish start. And here's the first for three. Hartenstein pulls it in. And here's New York now. Three first. The four run. Pass to Brunson. Here's Grimes. One fourteen left in the first quarter. Six to shoot. Second chance shot. Brunson misses. Cleveland has gone over three from downtown. On the wing, Mitchell. No good on the triple. So far this quarter, he's been out of sync and might be pressing right now. Randall outside. Back to Brunson. Julius Randle. That's been typical of their performance today. They're sharing the ball and creating good shots. Here's Mitchell. There it is. Mitchell. His confidence is off the charts right now. Off the dribble jumper. Yes, sir. Pass to Hartenstein. Back to Randle. And so he draws the ball. foul number 42, Desmond Wade. His first, second first team foul. Well, I'm in New York. Julius Randle. Taking two shots. And he makes it first. This is the for the New York Knicks. Number five, is there quickly. Number four, Derek Rose. And number one, Oni Toppet. New substitution for the Cleveland Cavaliers. Number 14, Danny Green. Number two, Sidney Osmond. And number 13, Ricky Rubio. That's the end of the first quarter of the period. Cleveland Cavaliers with six, and New York Knicks, 17. A good first start here for the for the good start of the, of the New York Times Square of the Knicks. We'll be right back with you after this.
Cleveland foul, number four. Evan Mobley. His second personal foul. First team foul. At the line for the New York Knicks, Emmanuel Quigley. At the line for two shots. This is not the only superstar that he was at the beginning of his career when he won that MVP, but he's still highly productive. And don't let this get things down on the board because this is the hard one for everybody else who's been playing for this game. It's not how you win, it's how hard you want to play. Don't get yourself uncomfortable if you're going to get this one thing done. Here's the position for the New York Knicks, so number 23, sure Mitchell Robinson, and number 9, R.J. Barrett. Did you ever uh, make a business decision? Yeah, B.A., you know, I made a few business decisions through my career. Look. As a competitor, you want to make sure that you can play defense, give it your all, contest at the rim when you feel that you can. But when someone like a Vince Carter in the midst of insanity, that's when you make a business decision. But that's a smart decision. Cleveland has gone over two from outside in the second quarter. Timeout, Cleveland. Major problems offensively. Definitely in a bit of a dry spell. Cleveland calls timeout. Trying anything now to get them out of this slump. This feels like the basket is looking awfully small to them right now. They're having a hard time getting anything to fall. As you are tuning into the NHL Stanley Cup playoffs on EA Sports, coming up will be the next one in part of the game, as we're about to be seeing later tonight, before the last part of the game, a double header set of the NBA and NHL. The first part of the game will be happening here with the New York Islanders back at PNC Arena playing against the Carolina Hurricanes. Following along with another game as we see another one playing with the matchup. It will be another one to take right towards the eye of this, of this zone. And that means the zone of a set of change, Wilds and the Jets back at XL Energy Center. Now those two are very aggressive right there. I'm seeing that the Wilds, I have never seen them winning a game here like this. But as of right now, I might be saying that this can be a very typical idea, and I might be seeing them win for a while. I have not seen them make it into the second round and part of a game since the last season for the start. It does usually turn out that it's going to be very uh, low agenda out there. Yeah, nothing to say about this one. It's going to be all coming up later tonight. Julius Randle from the low post. Randle's got five now. Making plays at both ends of the floor. And it shows up in the box score. Well, what I love is the energy they're bringing right now. They're ignoring the scoreboard and playing hard. Now here's Garland. He had a 21 point outing in their last game against New York. Free Isaac! Of course! Quickly, pass to Hart. Quickly, outside. Over Garland. It's wide right, it's off the rim. The Cavaliers have gotten only one of four shots to go in. Here's Mitchell, plenty of space. Free! Another! Mitchell! It's an opportunity to get speed set. Right side. And stolen by Mobley. And here they come. Here's Mitchell. Also plays like that are crucial right now. You have to convert on every turnover you get. Now here's Barrett. He's guarding closely. This is the layup. Boy, nine times out of ten, that's going in. I'm sure he surprised himself with the miss. Here's the Coro, guarded by quickly. Shot from 12. And it's good. Darius! Julius Redden. That's his throw. Derek Rose. Rose. 
on USC. And that replay showed how sensational that drive truly was. He had taken the onus on himself to make something happen. Got it into the teeth of the defense and made them pay. Julius Randall. This is from Josh Hart. Two minutes remain in the first half of the period. Two minutes. Now here's Hart. Tight defense on him. The NBA Playoffs on 2K Sports is brought to you by State Farm. Call or get a free quote now at 1-800-STATE-FARM. Like a good neighbor, State Farm is there. Ruffles, the official chip of the NBA. And by your local Kia dealers. A moment that inspires. We're nearing down the end of the first period. Coming up will be the halftime show. As right now, me and Mipo will be standing by here for the first half of the game. As right now, Cleveland Cavaliers are trying to fight their way in to make a close game and a connection run in the first half. The period is very not simple. It could be a very not tough one to keep it over, but we'll have to find out how will they do. Now back to Brian Anderson to close the first half of the game. Let's see what happens. Back to you. Checked in for Mobley. Wade comes in for Osman, and Levert subbed in for Okoro. The Knicks have gotten over 50% of their shots to go. Five for nine in the second. And here in the NBA, Osman has had his. Cleveland Brown. Number 22, Desmond Wade. His first, second personal foul. Second team foul. On the line for New York Knicks, number 23, Mitchell Robinson. On the line for two shots. skills are the first thing you think of when you think of Mitchell Robinson. But this guy is showing signs of improving on the offensive end as well. Yeah, just got to keep that easy here, Mitchell Robinson. I'm going to be too loose.
So you've got to continue to score, continue to build your lead. Levert passes to Garland. Time. Welcome back to 2K Sports, everybody. Ernie Johnson, Shaquille O'Neal, Kenny the Jet Smith. Let's talk about that first half. New York came out ready to play. Looking absolutely unstoppable off the tip. They put together a masterful 12-0 run. They found their rhythm early in this one, jumping out to an 11-point advantage. In the second quarter, they cooled off just a bit, but were still playing confident and were able to finish the half up by 10. And taking a look at the Jack, what do you think? They're losing great offense right now. Working the ball in the good spots, taking with the defense, losing, not forcing them shots. We'll see if they can maintain that discipline in the second half. And uh, Kenny, what do you see? Please. I hope. Please. The question is now, can they shake it off and get back in the move? Another option is compensate by going to the rest. And that should do it. With the second half about to begin, let's send you back to Kevin Harlan. Go back, Kevin Harlan. Go. Uh, Brian Anderson. Duh. Yeah, just fix that one up here. All right, guys. See you all later. Until post game show after the final bucks. <laughs> So on the floor for the Knicks, at the four and the five, it's Randall and Robinson. Jalen Brunson is out there with Josh Hart, and it's Barrett. Julius Randall. And guys, the way this defense is getting manhandled down low, you have to wonder if they're at 100% right now. Yeah, we just had to see that mobile one drive one more time. Great stuff. Making an impact. I love the aggression. Playing on that front foot and looking to This is by Brunson. Brunson. They have no answer defensively inside. Before he arrived in the NBA, Jalen Brunson had a ton of success in college. He's got a huge amount of Garland! Mitchell! Darius Garland with the assist. Mitchell Robinson. He can play the one guard, he can play the two guard, he can make open shots, he can get in the paint and score. Jalen Brunson is a big time contributor to a high quality basketball team. And it's the Cavaliers the ball, following the bucket by the Knicks. And Allen. Jerry! Allen! Allen! That is 
Starling with the assist. The Knicks have gotten three or four shots to fall so far in the third. It's hard on the wing. Back to Brunson. Outside Barrett. From outside the arc. The rebound by Allen. Sorry, that was a two-pointer. Three throws. Three throws. Here's Robinson. Allen defending. Back to Barrett. Back to Brunson. And here is Barrett. Here's the three. They get it back. Here's Randall. Julius Randall. Well, you love to see Julius Randall attack the offensive glass, get to a second chance opportunity. That's what Let's go. Cap. Have come off the clock. Back to Okoro. And there's the lob. Sure! Owen! Isaac Okoro with the six. Time out. New York Knicks. Yeah, coach, no doubt, wants to use this timeout to review the matchups and maybe make some adjustments as well. I just get a little bit of a break mentally, physically, just Hey guys, there's some tickets left here for the screening only here for the General W. Lynch Theater of the production for the VFDI and Anime Sandy experience. If you want to get your tickets now, you only have a 2 p.m. show to have the have your chance to see the season three of the Anime Sandy Invitational and also the VFDI TVOT of the new episode release bit. Here the creator of Jack and Jellyfy. That will be the separate part of the channels that you will that you don't want to miss. And yes, yes, guys, don't forget to use that one here. You can find it here on eventbrit.com and also get your tickets now here at animeinsanity.com slash tickets. Then the tickets won't be lasted long before they are sold out. So make sure you get your tickets here before the day of June hits the de deadline. And that will be happening. That will be not there anymore. So get yours now. And now back over to Brian Anderson. He's checked in for four. Green comes in for Donovan Mitchell. And Rubio is subbed in for Garland. So New York going with almost an entire new group here. Hardenstein. He's checked in for Robinson. Toppin comes in for Randall. Quickly is checked in for Barrett. And Rose is subbed in for Brunson. And Hardenstein. Gets it to go. Us is from Emmanuel quickly. Pass to Green. Allen with it. Guarded by Toppin. Only top. Emmanuel quickly with the assist. On display, rises up with ease. Outside, green. It's rebounded by New York. They led the game at one point. Under two minutes of play in the first quarter period. Two minutes. Here's Toppin. Oh, and then foul. Number four, Evan Mobley. They score a personal foul. They receive that. On the line for New York Knicks. Oh, he's up it. On the line for two shots. And a chance for a moment to check out the scoring breakdown for the Knicks. I mean, they play some beautiful basketball all game. The passing has been impressive, and it's opened up things with their ball movement. And you also Shoot have two. to love the way they've gotten out and run in transition. A ton of good chances tonight simply from being willing to run the floor. I think one thing that's clear with Ogun Toppin is he has a drive to keep improving. He knows he's got some talent, but it's about the work you put in. And the Cavaliers making a change here. Levert's checked in.
45 left in the third quarter of the game. Rubio passes to Levert. Now here's Allen. Witching foul for the Knicks. Isaiah Hardensock. His first personal foul. First team foul. your score. We'll see how this happens. And we take a listen in now to Tom Thibodeau on a recent huddle. Something Coach Tibbs always preaches. Defense, defense, defense. It's his area of expertise and he takes it very seriously. And this is it. Glad to have you along for this fourth quarter. Robinson. Mitchell Robinson. And the Knicks lead by seven. 
Well, Mitchell Robinson plays such a critical role for them on the interior. If he can consistently make these shots, what a weapon he is. No lack of aggression on that move. Good for the 2K drive. Now here's Garland. Here's Mobley. Ooh, Robinson with a block. And he recovers it. On the wing, Mitchell. Back to Garland. Launches it. Rebounds in the game. Pass to Barrett. Back to Brunson. Randall with it. Outside Brunson. Over Garland. And it's off the back of the rim. No good. Boy, this guy just can't fly a bucket, and yet they have the advantage. Here's the Coro. Sure, Allen! Five for five. Jared Allen continues to do the dirty work down low. This guy is so fundamentally sound. Robinson against Allen. Back to Brunson. Pass to Grimes. Kicks it out to Barrett. Out left to the wing. Now here's Robinson. Allen defending. Robinson passes to Randall. 24 second violation, shot clock, Cavaliers ball! Here's the position for New York Knicks, number three, Josh Hart. Mitchell with the ball, pass to Okoro. And here's Allen. New York crowd, number 23, Mitchell Robinson. His first personal foul, first team foul. Out the line for the Cleveland Cavaliers. Jared Allen. Out of line for two shots. Good job drawing that foul. He misses the free throw. Don't try to get upset already because Jared Allen's just trying to work on its way on its run. Yeah. And because of that one, it really has to keep that one going. You don't want that one to get messed up and get caught already. Mitchell Robinson, official assisted by Julius Randle. Josh Hart. Time out Cleveland Guys. So here's a look at the playoff uh, bracket inbound here for the NBA. Right now, it looks like a New York Knicks could be their next stop, defeat, and finally make their way to the first round to head on to the second round to face against the Milwaukee Bucks. Now it's their next stop as they will be heading in towards here at Pfizer Duff 4. And then across the angle we have another angle as we got the Clippers and the Suns. Nope, Clippers and the Nuggets at Mile High. That will be coming up there later for tonight. So keep your eyes peeled as we got the next game coming up underway to get you caught up and you will be seeing what the next matchup could be. The tournament in between. Two timeouts remaining for the New York Knicks and one timeout remaining for the Cleveland Cavaliers. And as right now, just and the next game coming up, we will have the number one to take you here. And then we will head you back to NHL as we have game seven of the Wilds and the Jets. 9.30 p.m. later tonight. Time for a new balance player of the game. Ryan?
chances out there by attacking the rim. Well, they are playoff bound with him rounding into form and playing some of his best basketball. They just got to continue to play together. We'll see if he's able to keep playing at this level. All right, let's get a report from Ellie. Jamie Baker's staff had some words for his team over the break. Jalen Brunson. This Brown. Josh Hart. Very tough cover, guys. Cleveland is going one for five shooting from the arc here in the fourth. Unload for 13. Two minutes remain in the fourth quarter of the period. Two minutes. Barrett with it. Takes a three. RJ Barrett for three. This Brown. Jalen Brunson. Fourth assist with that last one. with the six. It's Robinson, high post. Outside Hart. Back to Brunson. It's Barrett on the wing. Three corner, no good. Next 
Personal foul on Darius Carlin, number 10. His first personal, 13 foul. Other line for New York, Jalen Brunson, 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 Jalen Sports is brought to you by AT&T 5G. Fast, reliable, and secure. Mountain Dew, do to do. And by American Express. Don't live life without it. If you're with us for the next game, we've got the Clippers and the Nuggets here playing at Mile High here in Denver, Colorado. That's the part of the next game that will be happening here, standing by. We have his paintbrush, along with the other uh, crew, as we have his silver spoon. And the fur commentary of the crew, we have a stickle. All three commentaries will be here to bring us on for the next part of the game, as you will be seeing how well will they do for the next part. And as being said right now, Denver Nuggets is not the bad place to be here. But that's for a team. They've always wanted to get there, they wanted to get the source, all of them done. Last possession. This is it. Do or done. Third or cut. Cavs. Back to Ryan. Mitchell, the pass to Allen. Sure! Allen! Oh, shot brings it within three. You have to love their intensity right now. Getting hot. Cleveland file number four. Admiral Blake, his four person, 14 pounds. Here's the New York, number 23, Mitchell Robinson. The line for two shots. back-to-back -back switch. Well, as you can see right now, this is a tough one. This could be it for the New York Knicks. If they don't show it off, then the Cavaliers may have a chance to win it or done it all. It might done it all in this part of the game because this is it. No timeouts for Cleveland Cavs. As right now, the Knicks only have one more timeout remaining. As right now, they only have a lot of possession to try to take them over and then do it under again. This is hard, but nothing is going to take over with the better plays, this example. Because if that happens, then we're all done. All right. Well, this is it. This is going to be a win or not. We'll be right back with you after this. All right. This is it. Decision starts now. Do or done.
That's the end of regulation. We are going to overtime. back to the action. Oh man, they just missed it. Well, we'll have some overtime now because it's coming up after this. Be right back with you right after this short break. And now we get set for overtime. And it's overtime. Get up! Make some noise! Let's go, Ken. New York Prop. Number nine, RJ Barrett. They score a first little foul. First team foul. On the line for Cavs, Jared Allen. On the line for two. Good substitution for the Cleveland Cavaliers. Number three, Garris LeBron. Time is brought to you by your local Kia dealers. This is your local Kia dealer here today, a moment that inspires. As we are about to be seeing, since we've seen them in season four, this was their game that was ever happening here on 2K20. This was never usually before, but this part of the game was happening to be ever released here since we've seen them playing each other long period of time. Well, as I mentioned here before, you know that this was a very tough. Both guys, they've done a very hard job on that one. The gauge of this one is, it's not how you win. It's how you, it's not how you lose. It's about how you finish it up and get it over with the win. All we do is work together and do it as our team. Granted, that being said, it might be a very tough one that we might be showing it off. Here at Knicks 1 in season, back in season 4. But right now, we'll have to see what happens with the win or go home. Here we go. Back to you, Brian.
Julius Randle, this well, RJ Barrett. It's more one drive, dang it. for both teams, and here we go. Under 30 seconds left, let's find out who has next. Brian? Louder! Email here. Mitchell Robinson. Final timeout for Cleveland Cavaliers. I guess this might be very tough to find out what will happen now because this is going to be very tough to find out who will take the win. Cavaliers have never won a game here in the first round of the NBA playoffs since they met each other back against Cleveland uh, in Cleveland, Ohio, facing against the Milwaukee Bucks. That's about the roughest team that everyone's been facing. 
The only offense may have never picked it up was a hard one to bring it in between. Yeah, you can't just say that whenever you're going to go for it, you just don't want that to go uh, right towards the team. And it might be very aggressive to maintain the run, so it may be tough to find out who will they get. All right, here it goes now. The struggle starts now. Cavaliers with no timeouts. One timeout remaining for Tom Pibio. Richard Powell, bro, called on Jalen Brunson. Of course, 13 foul. A line for Cavaliers. There he is, Scarlett. A line for two shots. remaining, they got to get this done. Puts it up off the inbound. This is off the left eye. New foul, number three, Josh Hart. A second personal foul, 14 foul. A line for the big guys. There is Scarlett. Two, Two shots. R.J. Barrett for three. The New York Knicks foul. Number three, Josh Hart. His first personal foul. Fifteen foul. A line for the Cavaliers. Harris Lever taking two shots. Position for the New York Knicks, Eric Rose, Evan Fournier, as well as his desire and to Joe and Jeremy Sims. New substitution for the Cleveland Cavaliers, Lance Stevens and Robin Lopez. Looks like the team at the Cavaliers are going to be moving on. And there you go. If you make sway in, it's all over. Julius Randle. It's four personal foul. 17 foul. A line for the Cavaliers, Jerry Donovan Mitchell. A line for two.
Come first with drops. And that gives him a four-point cushion. This is exactly what comes with having the basketball late and becoming the focal point of your team for Donovan Mitchell, making these free throws is critical. And so he drops them both. That's a five-point game. Outside Brunson. And that's your game! Your final score, Cleveland Cavaliers, 85, and New York Knicks, 80. Thank you so much for your all the wonderful the part of the playoff and this was the longest period of the game for the NBA playoffs to finish the first round of the game and yes I tell you this one Cleveland Cavaliers are moving on to take on in Milwaukee to face against the Bucks yeah this is, was the biggest part of a disaster game since we noticed you on 2k sports but if not it always happens here, and, and just for real times, it really has to happen with most of the players being caught up and being injured up for one reason. As we know that Giannis Antetokounmpo is already out, and the team's already gone right now in the in Pfizer form. It was too much to, be, uh, to carry on, but it was all that did happen because it was very tough, very brutal, and painful how it turned out. Yep, and to just tell you how this one really does, it does really just take a lot of a moment to realize how hard they had worked on. Every moment it does appeal, they just keep on going. They just enjoy it themselves. And right now, here's the total statistics. As right now, we have come into the last part in game number seven. 52 percentage for the field goals for the Knicks. 36, 75 Cavaliers. And the then the fast break points, 16, 52, 9, 16, 29, 14, 26. That's going to be on the Knicks. Two steals. That's even up. Three blocks for the Knicks. Three out of four turnovers. Points off for the Knicks. Then eight for the Cleveland Cavaliers. Five biggest dunks here for the Knicks. Along with 20 and 14, 29 time of the possession. And yep, yeah, as you can tell right now, they're all out. Yep, New York Knicks and Brooklyn Nets are out. Because they are already been eliminated. So right now, as we're about to be standing by with the last part of the three-star players of the game of the first round of the NBA playoffs, let's start with you, Meatphone. All right. Thank you so much. Third start of the game, we go out to one of the biggest part of the games, the upset early on, and we have J Julius Randle. 19 points, 11 rebounds, 5 assists. Only had performed two dunks and 30 performance run, and turned out one of the best. So that is turning out to be just how terrific he does from this game. And next season will be the live on until new season of the 23-24 season. Now on to you. All right, thank you. As right now, the next star goes to Donovan Mitchell. 23 points, 1 rebound, 5 assists, and a 34 performance run. Mates 3 three-pointers in the outside of their range. The mark comes in good shape. Doing really well from every game angles. It's just a hard one and you keep on. And now for you, me phone for number one. Well, number one, I'm going to have to give a huge credit right now. And this one goes to Darius Garland. 25 points, 3 rebounds, 5 assists, 1 steal, 1 dunk. Man, he's like on a crazy fast run. 37 performance run. And 8 out of 16 field goal percentage. 3 out of 8 free pointers and, and perfect free throws at the free throw line. Well done for Darius Garland 
And her team moving on to face against the Bucks of Deonis Anakupo. So that were being said, game one will be the next one to be determined here for the Cavaliers and the Bucks. So the NBA playoffs of the first round has been concluded. We are now in the second round already since we already have just started. Plus, don't forget about the next part of the game as we're about to be seeing the Clippers and the Nuggets. If you're tuning us here for the next part of the game, don't worry, we got your eyes covered on here. It's coming up here later, so be sure to stay tuned as we got more underway in just a moment. Peace out everyone for as a while as the NBA playoffs on 2K Sports Style. This is Son of Beast along with me, phone. Thanks for joining with us, and we'll see you again next time. Take care, guys, and have a wild night at Cleveland Town, along with the next season of the Big Apple of New York. If you don't, if you don't, somebody will.